Puppets are a great tool to have in your house. They really help kids release and express their emotions without actually really having to speak directly about themselves and what they're feeling. You can use them if your kid is having a transition. What's, what's your name? Kaden. Okay. Um, what's your name? Oh, my name is um, Leonora. Oh. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Oh. Or afraid of a new thing, going to a doctor. You can't be brave. There's all kinds of puppets out there. Find one that speaks to your kids' interests. Animals, princesses. We did a game called Puppet Problems, for example, where the puppet has a problem. It's a simple thing. Even the kids can come up with what that problem is. This parrot swallowed gum, needs help. You know, the lion is too afraid to even go to school. Does anybody else have any tips for how to be brave? In that context, kids can offer advice, problem solve together, and actually empower themselves if you think they're going through a similar problem. Kids are empowered to come up with solutions to their own problems. Why don't you try, try to talk to people and, um, slowly and then you can probably... Um... Try to talk to people slowly, like this. Hello. With these puppets, they can practice empathy, they can practice problem solving, and work through these big emotions in a safe way.